Okay, so there's nothing much we can really do now except wait for Michael, so let's see what this favor is. God dang it. These cars just know how to annoy me. What I'm actually going to do real quickly first is talk to the FBI agent to lower all of our... Um... Oh, uh, God, what is the word? Vendetta. So we don't have to worry about anybody randomly attacking us. It's the Okay, since you ain't been causing too much trouble, I can help you out for a reasonable price. If you work in the Corleone case, shut it. Kabish? No. So the Barzinis don't hate us. And that was the really the only family that didn't like us. Well, we can check right here. Okay, we're peaceful with everybody. Cool. Like I said, that'll ensure nobody will come and attack us. Oh, come on. Get, get out of the car. Get out of the car. That's right. Who's shooting at me? The cops? Oh, I'm back at Clemenza's place. Well, if it isn't Mr. I can't break up a protest without the whole fucking world finding out. Clemenza, come on. Why the grief? I'll tell you why. You cracked some skulls at the protest, so the cops decided to crack down on me. Real fucking fair. I think you owe me one, right? Of course. Sorry. What do you need? These guys here tip me off. The cops are on their way to raid my house. Anything I don't want them to find is on that truck. I need you to drive the truck to Paulie's old safe house. Don't let the cops get you. There's shit in there that could get us all busted. Clemenza got a tip that cops have a warrant to search his house. He's loaded some incriminating evidence into a truck and needs it stashed at Paulie's old apartment. Don't let the cops interfere. And payday. We got 50 grand. Actually, if you guys were confused, uh, oh, oh, there's the cops. The protest he's talking about was one there, um, when I was extorting businesses, it put me into a favor where there was a union protesting one of my businesses. All I had to do was go there and punch a few guys to break up the strike, and apparently that's what he's angry about. So oh, you gotta be kidding. Me. Well, we're gonna have to start over. Dude, I got so freaking screwed. That was so stupid. I was doing perfectly fine, and then the stupid cop car blows up, which causes my car to blow up. Yeah, okay. Ugh. So pointless.
Sorry. I need Leave your me alone. Now you see why I hate those stupid missions where you gotta either duh, run away from the cops or whatever. Try it one more time. They better not have to make me listen to him talk. to receive messages. I still have all my heat. I gotta go into my safe house now. This is Michael. I wanna meet you and Fredo at the Peak Hotel in Midtown. Make sure to have some dynamite. Oh, great. Do I have dynamite? Yes. Okay. Oh wait, where's the Peak Hotel? Screw that, I'm taking my... I'm calling a cab. There we go. Should be a very close drive now. I would think. Yep. I don't even care. <laughs> Usually I make a comment when I hit a car, I just don't even care. Can I extort it while I'm here? <laughs> Probably not. No, I doubt it. I don't own it yet, and we're about to blow it up. Oh, can I buy the safe house? Yes, I can. And I lost almost all of my money. But I don't care. Now I'm poor again. Ain't that nice? 
Michael's right hand man. It's an honor, sir. A royal flush. Casino mogul Mo Green has prospered under the Corleone protection, but his growing power stands in the way of Michael's ambitions in Las Vegas. Fredo Corleone, Michael's brother, learning the casino business from Mo Green. Long time no see, Pally. Hello, Fredo. How you been? Good. Great. So, you here to sample the good life? I mean, what can I get you? Nah, I'm here to meet Mike. Michael? Michael? What is, what does he want? Mikey, you look good. What brings you here? Fredo, sit down. Hear me out. Sure, Mike. But what is it? What's going on? We're taking down the hotel, Fredo. Tonight. But now. But why? This is Moe's operation. He, he's my friend, Mikey. Moe's dirty, Fredo. You know he refused my offer. I can't allow that to happen. Uh, God damn it. This can't be right. Now, I need you to do something for me. Just name it. There's a secret casino in the basement. You're going to clean it up. It's members only. So get the password from one of the hotel workers. I got it. Good. I won't let you down. I don't expect you will. So we're taking down a casino. Okay, let's split. <laughs> 